me avocado jada and today i am going to be filming a i'm going to be filming a sneaker collection video just to warn you guys i actually do not have like i feel like my sneaker like i feel like my sneaker collection is actually like really black and boring it kind of is i really don't have a lot of sneakers i mean i feel like i have a lot of sneakers like i don't have i just don't have like a giant collection like i'm gonna like show you guys this is all my sneakers well these are all my like sneakers that are in boxes and then over here we have all the sneakers basically all my miscellaneous shoes and i was just gonna do like my sneakers but i guess i'll do all my shoes i'm gonna do an outfit of the day first because i just feel like i should do that so basically i have on this like i don't know what this is it's like an overall dress thingy i never wear this outfit outside and this outfit is like i'm gonna wear it outside so if y'all see me see me wearing this on in an instagram picture don't say anything i got this from forever 21 for three dollars three dollars <sighs> I'm out of breath. I don't know why I'm out of breath and my nose is running. Then I just have on this. Also, by the way, I'm using my camera for the first time. So if it's not in focus or if I keep looking at like, if it looks like I'm looking up instead of like directly at the camera, it's because I'm looking in the viewfinder and this is my first time filming a video on this camera. So I might be doing a lot of weird stuff, but yeah, I have on this art gallery shirt it says head crack on it on the bottom but you can't see that because of this thing but yeah i just have this on this is my outfit super cute so basically i'm gonna start with the wax shoes pretty much all right first pair of shoes i'm gonna show you guys are my crocs these are my crocs i don't know they're just the tie-dye crocs I don't really wear them as much as I used to. I used to wear them all the time in college. And I really mainly got them for college, really. I don't really wear them now. I usually wear my Uggs. Oh, I have those too, but they're downstairs. Because I wear them all the time, like, when I go outside. But, yeah, I have my Ugg furry slides. That's another pair of shoes that I have that I can't really show you right now. But, just know that they exist. I, I know you guys know what I'm talking about. Okay, so next pair of shoes that I own... Um, are these Nike blazers? These are just like the leather. I don't know if they're real leather, but they're just these leather navy blue Nike blazers. And I only wore these like two times. As you can see, the bottoms are freaking clean as heck. They're the Nike blazers, navy blue Nike blazers. I have these Continental 80 Adidas. They're just like lime green. I don't know if it's focused or not. But yeah, um, I wear these a lot, as you can tell. They look pretty crazy, but I don't wear these anymore at all. I don't know, I don't know, like I can't imagine myself just walking around with these lime green shoes on. I'm selling them on Depop, but no one has like requested to buy them yet. So follow my Depop, I'll link it down below. Next, I have these flats. <laughs> I don't know. They're just flats. I got them for Forever 21. Just because, you know, flats is essential to have for a girl. Especially if you need, I don't know, like if I need to wear something professional, put them flats on. Even though they're ugly as heck. Next pair of shoes that I have are these Adidas Samba. Um, They're like basically like platforms, kind of, sort of. And they're just gray. And they're like suede not suede i don't know what this material is but this is what it is i don't ever wear these either honestly i don't wear them at all next pair of shoes i have are these checkered vans i do not wear these at all honestly you can see that the bottoms are still pretty clean i i like never wore these even when they were like popular i've probably only wore them about seven times or less than that honestly like i i didn't really wear these that much even though it has a big old stain on it, it look like i wear them a lot but i did not wear them that much honestly should i bring these back like i don't know nobody wears checkered vans anymore like these are still 2016 17 
these were really popular back then. I don't know if you guys remember. But these are my checkered vans. If you want a pair of checkered vans, I should sell them on Depop. I mean, honestly, nobody's looking for checkered vans anymore these days. These are probably so easy to find. Nobody would buy them unless I'm selling them for like $10. Next pair of shoes that I have are these black Converse. Um, I have these for like three years. I still wear them, but not really. Like, I'll wear them if I can't find any other shoe to wear. But I wore these a few months ago. Like, the last time I wore them was one time in June, like when we got out of quarantine. I shouldn't have these so close to my face, but yeah. I got these for my birthday from someone, but these are like so dingy and like washed out. Next pair of shoes I have are these white leather vans and I wear these shoes a lot, if you can't tell. Like these were like my Air Force ones for me back in 2018. And I wore these a lot in college too because these were like the I don't care shoes like most of the shoes that I have here I probably did wear them in college because like I didn't care about how I looked that much in college and I usually would wear like leggings and stuff in college and sweats and I feel like these shoes didn't really they weren't like big and bulky and they didn't make my feet look really big and they just worked well with like leggings and stuff so yeah white vans warning there's gonna be like five more pair of vans I dragged it but I have six pairs of vans. These vans that I have right here, these are, I don't know. I got these last year, I think, and I really liked them last year, but I'm not really a fan of them right now. Like, these are cute. I only wear them like four or five times, or less than that, honestly. I don't know. I like them, but I don't know. I don't know. Not really my style anymore. Next pair of vans. I have are, are these old school um, yacht, no these aren't the yacht club ones, so those are the next ones. I don't know what these are called, but they're the blue and black ones. And these were my babies, like I wore the heck out of these. These were like my favorite shoes. These are just like, I don't ever wear these, like ever, like ever anymore. But yeah. <sighs> next pair of bands I have are these. are these as you can see i wore these the heck out of these but these are the yacht club ones everybody was like obsessed with these when i first got them people were like oh my god what are those i've never seen those before like everybody was seeing it and then all of a sudden it's because when i got them they didn't really have that many in stock maybe and then like they sold out but then eventually like they restocked so like now everybody can get their hands on them but these were hard to get your hands on after i got them but yeah these were my favorite shoes because they have literally every like i could if i wanted to wear vans with this outfit i could totally wear it with this outfit i have two more pairs of shoes left on the side i just have these red and white checkered vans these were my babies i wear the heck out of these i could also wear with this outfit honestly all these vans i could wear with this outfit but would i no next pair of shoes i have are these um adidas they're like really mushed in right now but these are the adidas um I forgot what they're called, but they're kind of ugly. But I would still wear them to like run and work out and stuff. These are like the only pair of like workout shoes that I have. So I don't care how ugly they are. They comfortable too. So yeah, they have a little stain right there. That's all the shoes that I have that are not in boxes that are just like laying around that I do not wear at all. Next, I'm going to show you guys all of these shoes which are the shoes that I do have in boxes, which this will probably go by pretty fast because I don't really have that many in my opinion. But, you know, I don't know, to some people it might be a lot of shoes. To me, it's really, like, I feel like my sneaker collection is really whack. But, you know, to you guys, to some people out there, it might be great. But it's not, I promise you guys that it's not. But you guys are gonna see. I guess I'll start off with this side right here because these are also shoes that I don't really wear but they're just like in boxes because I have the box. First things first is my Nike slides. Um, I used to wear these a lot but now that I have like carpet in my house, I really don't wear shoes in my house at all. This is, I would really just wear them as house shoes or I'd wear them like outside real quick. But my Ugg slides are taking that position right now because they're just downstairs and then the first, they're the first shoes that I grab first pair of shoes that I have I don't know what this is honestly because it says Air Jordan 
9 Retro BG. I don't know what the heck that means, but it says that, but I know it's not the right shoe in here. So it's going to be a little surprise to me too. Also, I have other shoes too. They're actually downstairs in the garage and they're 9s. I'm going to insert a picture of them right here but they're the air jordan nines i have no idea what the name of them are but they're all black really and then i have another pair of air force i have a pair of air force ones and they're like burgundy i don't really like them all right so i just lowered my camera because i wanted to sit down on my butt instead of kneeling like i've been doing this whole entire time but yeah i have the like they're like high top ones and they're burgundy and they have like a gum bottom they're not really that cute to me anymore but i just i don't know i just kept i just be keeping my shoes for some reason i don't know what oh okay so these say that they're the nines and they say that they're size six actually these might be a size six but these are actually the i forgot what these are called actually i don't know you guys gotta tell me what these are called but these are fives i know that i think they're like midnight Nah, that's not the name of them. I don't know what these are called. But, yeah. I just don't like the fact that this tongue is so, like, meaty. Like, it's so thick and meaty. But if I had a pair of fours or threes that fit me still from 10th grade, 11th grade. Because I have the cement fours, the Jordan cement fours. And I had a lot of, I had, like, two pairs of threes. But, you know, my feet grew, so they didn't fit me anymore. So I sold them. But I actually wore the cement fours like a few months ago too, but I wore them one time and I was in the car and I couldn't walk anymore with them because my feet were hurting. So I sold them, but yeah. These, um, these are these. Don't know what they're called. They could match with this outfit that I have on now, but I would not to wear Jordans. Well, I would not wear these type of Jordans with this outfit. Cause these just, it just won't look right to me. It's a, I would wear like ones or threes or fours with it. It's just this meaty tongue that just does it for me. Like, no. Next pair of shoes I'm going to show you guys are Converse's. And they are these, they look really dirty. Like, I have a problem with not cleaning my shoes. But they're basically like this platform. I think they're called Lugged. They're, yeah, they're the lugged or lugged lugged um, Converse's and actually I got these shoes in like December like I had my eyes on them for forever and this This is when nobody really knew about these but now people are fiending for these shoes for some reason like I don't know I guess I over wore them and now I'm just like over them because I do not wear them at all anymore This would go with this outfit too That I have on right now, but I don't know I never wore them in the summertime yet like I feel like these just look more like a boot to me like i don't know how to wear these in the summer they could probably be easy but i feel like it'll just make me look dumb because i'm so skinny but i've seen them on like bigger thicker people and taller people and they look better on me i just feel like it doesn't look right i feel like it doesn't look right with shorts and skirts and stuff i feel like it looks good with like pants like oversized pants but that's just my opinion on them on me but yeah these shoot these shoes right here next pair of shoes that I have are also probably in the wrong box. It says that these are the Air Jordan 4 Retro OGs. Yep, these are. this is the box for the Cement 4s, but these are not the Cement 4s in here. These are ones. These are the, I don't remember what these are called at all, honestly. I think these are like chrome. No, they're not chrome. I don't know, but they're like reflective kind of. And the bottom, no, the bottom looks nasty now. Oh, you can kind of see how it was like the bottom was like sparkly kind of like reflective these are the ones i'll put the name of it on the screen i guess later on or in, i'll put them in the description but and the aglet is like nope it's not focused oh yeah it's focused now well now it's focused on me again okay well yeah the aglet is like cool because it's not just like a normal aglet next pair of shoes that i'm going to show you guys are adidas apparently and these are another pair of shoes that i don't wear at all but you know they're there because i have the box these are the these are samoas they're just white and orange samoas um they feel very cheap i don't wear these at all i only wear these like as you can see the bottom is really clean i only wear these probably like three times but yeah these are these um they're not really nothing special just orange and white samoas next is a pair of nikes and 
I know exactly what these are. These are gonna be so boring to show you. These are just some black blazers, all black blazers, and I took the shoelaces out because I don't wear them. I never ever wear them actually. Yeah, I took a shoelace out because I needed a shoelace for whatever reason. I don't know, maybe to use it as a belt or like as a hair tie because you know I use it for my puffs. It's just black blazers, nothing special. Probably never gonna wear them ever. I'm selling them on Depop as well, but nobody wants to buy shoes with no laces. Next, we're going into the shoes that I wear a lot. So, like both these rows are just the shoes that I wear a lot and I'm probably gonna breeze through these. Okay, so this shoe actually is at right at the top because it's brand new. I just got these. I ordered them like a month or two ago. But yeah, these are just the pine green ones. And I just wanted a pair of ones. Actually, I had my eye on these for months, but I just decided. I just, I just, it's just so hard for me to pay more than $200 for sneakers. Like, it just makes my heart break when I gotta do that. But I decided to just treat myself and buy myself them. Um, everybody has these though, a lot of people have them. But these are like the cheapest ones that you can get right now because like they're like the most newest ones. Well, they're not the newest ones and they're not the cheapest ones. The cheapest ones that you could get are probably mids, but I'm not wearing mids. I'm not buying mids. And the cheapest ones that you could probably get right now are probably the gray and red ones that just came out like a few days ago or a, few, a week ago. I don't know when it came out. Yeah, I just got them off StockX. They came with the red laces that I'm probably not going to utilize. And they came with this little tag that you need to cut off. I'm tired of people walking around with this freaking little thing on their shoes. Like, what are you doing? Next pair of shoes that I'm going to show you guys are these Nikes. I got them from StockX as well. These are the Air Zoom Sparadon Cage 2. And these are just them. Um, I don't really like them that much. I wore them on my birthday. I wore them one time after that. Really only wore them two times. Yeah, but these are these. Um, they're just white and blue. They're see-through. So I need to wear them before the summer's over because... I can these are not a winter shoe at all as you can see they're like netted and they're very like see-through next pair of shoes i'm gonna show you guys are nike they say that they're nike blazers i'm assuming that the first blazers that i showed you belong in this box but they're not these are actually the nike m2k technos i love i used to love these shoes these were once my favorite shoe they're like um reflective and they're like orange yeah they're they're really cute to me i haven't worn them in a while though but and they have like a marble print on the bottom it looks like it's just dirty but it's actually a marble print next pair of shoes that i'm going to show you guys are a recent pickup i got them from Foot Locker. these are just the nike p6000s they're gold and red and white and i actually really like these they're really cute but yeah these are these i paid like 60 dollars for them really cheap um, I wear them one time and yeah love these they're pretty comfortable too next pair of shoes I'm gonna show you guys are literally a staple for everybody's like wardrobe everybody and their mom has these shoes these are the Nike Air Force ones I would wear that with this outfit that I have on right now but yeah I have these since last year you know usually people like buy new ones I was gonna buy new ones but honestly they're not that bad so i didn't i really was going to but shade my friend convinced me to just clean them so i just cleaned them and i'm probably this is probably gonna be the last summer that i wear these shoes honestly but they're not cooked like they're not bad so mind your business mind your business but yeah these are just those they're really cute you know just regular white low air force one next Last pair of shoes that's in this row, then I only have like a few pairs of shoes left. Are these, oh, my voice said, my voice cracked. You are the um, Nike Shocks Nova sneakers. Um, I saw these in Kith and I didn't get them, but then I decided to order them online and I got them for cheap from Finish Line. I got them for cheaper than the original price was. And now I think they're back to their original price, so I'm glad I got them when I did. They're so cute. I love these shoes. They're so cool. These are some fire shoes right here. I love these. Okay, so that was the last pair of shoes in that row. Next, we just have this row. I only got one, two, three, four more pairs of shoes to show you guys. These shoes right here are the Feet Aruchi. I love these shoes, actually. I wore them for like a week straight last week because 
not on purpose but only because i had to yeah i got this these fiorucci adidas sneakers i'm gonna like really like go in depth with these shoes because this is just they're just beautiful like okay so the laces say fiorucci and they're black and then oh, i showed you guys these i forgot i showed you guys these in a video my last video they have a pink aglet the back is just neon yellow if you guys can see that and then the side says love and the other side is different it says what is love question mark question mark question mark yeah it says what is love and the inside is so cute like i just love these shoes i've got a lot of compliments on these shoes as well because i've never seen anybody with them so you know me unique jada next pair of shoes that i have are como de garçons and these are the only pair of como de garçons that i have i had two other pairs i had the low ones with the small heart and then i had i had like the basic ones the plain white ones the high top white ones with the big heart but these are the first pair of como de garçons that i ever owned i got them in like 2015 and they look kind of crazy but i don't think i'm gonna ever get rid of these because they're just like my like first pair of shoes that i really like got on my own that i really like that nobody else had that people were like waiting for like i don't know they were just like a shoe that i really wanted i mean a lot of people had them but like people like were fiending for these shoes when i got them and now you can't even like get them at all so like i don't think i'm gonna sell these but i sold my other ones because well the other one that i had is another pair that you can't really get you can't really find but these ones don't you really can't find these so yeah but and these i got these back when they were only oh these cost 140 but these were 140 but the other ones that the other ones that are 140 now used to be like 110 120 and now they're 140 and if these were to sell now like if they were to like not resell them but if they were to like restock these and like sell the pro leather ones again it would probably be like 160 or something because they upped the price on all the cdgs because cdgs became so popular which is annoying but good for them but like dang and second to last pair of shoes i'm going to show you guys actually i have a pair of heels i can show you guys it's not really like a sneaker though but i already showed you guys like flats so i might as well just show you guys the heels but these are my babies these were my favorite shoes last summer like i used to love these shoes these are my golf lafleur they're purple i get a lot of compliments on these shoes when i wear these but they're just like this velvet like do you guys see they look beautiful on camera first of all they're just like these velvet purple sneakers this is not even the best shoe the best shoe is this one because it has the flower on the side these are shoes that i probably won't sell either well i don't know how i'm gonna fill in a few years or a few months even but i love these shoes the bottom have flowers on them as well the side has the same white flower and then on the tongue it says golf le fleur converse and if you didn't know these are tyler the creator's um shoes and it came with this bag just says golf le fleur converse but it came with these um velvet laces which i probably won't use at all i don't know like, i feel like that would be a bit much if i were to put the purple laces in it but these were my favorite pair of shoes at a point honestly most of these shoes were once my favorite pair of shoes at a point last pair of sneakers i'm going to show you are my yeezys these are literally the only yeezys that i have and i don't wear them i wear them a lot in the winter time but like they don't look good on my feet with like shorts and like skirts and stuff and like you know my legs are just entirely too skinny and these shoes are entirely too bulky for me to wear them with like no they just don't look right i feel like these are another pair of shoes that i could only wear with like baggy pants but yeah these are them um they're just the 500s i don't remember what i think these are stone yeah these are the stone ones and yeah you guys know how easy these look um fun fact i wore them to a new year's party and lord that was a big mistake that was a giant mistake because i my feet got stomped out they look pretty dirty now but they looked worse after that new year's party like they looked crazy i had to get someone to help me clean them like it was just terrible i wish i didn't wear them to the new year's party because then they would look a lot more fresh but hey they don't look that bad to me it's not really for sneakers but i'm just gonna show you guys anyways because they're here so 
these are just some heels that i got and i just wore them on my birthday they're so pretty though i love them they have these butterflies on these oh i keep putting these shoe bottoms so close to my face but they're just these butterfly sneak i mean sneakers heels they're see-through and they're like chromish as you can tell but yeah i love these shoes i wear them on my birthday also have another pair of heels i guess i could show you guys they were also silver but they're not as cool as the other ones they're just steve madden i got these ones from ego official so thank you guys so much for watching my sneaker haul no sneaker collection video once again I don't know what I'm saying, but make sure you subscribe to my channel, Avocado Jada. Comment down below your favorite sneakers that I own. Comment down your least favorite sneakers that I own. Comment down below some sneakers that you think that I should purchase. Because, you know, I do need some new sneakers. Tomorrow, I'm trying to get those off-white fours, and I have a strong, strong feeling that I'm not going to get them. But I'm going to try to put some positivity into the air and manifest it so that I can get them. But I really, really have a strong feeling that I won't because... I'm not even going to go into that. But thank you guys for watching. Um, make sure you subscribe to Avocado Jada to join the Avocado family. And comment down below what you guys think about this camera quality. Yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.